Well, good day to you wherever you are. You join us on a day where the weather just may have an impact on a football match that has been uh, much anticipated. It's dry at the moment, but the forecast is that it will be wet, perhaps very wet by the time the game is uh, underway and certainly by the time of the second half. The crowd, though, are here and they are in good form. There's a right old cacophony going on. The atmosphere is terrific and kickoff is moments away. And we have in front of us this gloriously imposing arena, absolutely picture perfect for a game of this nature. Mallorca have opted for a 4 4 2 formation. Reminders of a, a golden era in English football, I should add. And it continues to hold its place in the modern game. Playing a second striker runs the risk of being outnumbered in midfield, of course. So, with the wider pairing and fullbacks, plenty of running has to be part of their play. And, of course, the right service into the box. And that gets things running. Jim, you've played in games of this nature. Who can make the difference? Yeah, Nabil Fekir. He's just so hard to stop when he's moving at pace, Peter. He's got real end product too, and the opposition defence will be wanting to make sure he doesn't get any shots away. I think he's going to add a lot of dynamism to this attack, and that might prove decisive today. Well, quite no argument for me on that one. Canales. Shot a goal! Great effort, beautifully taken. Ah, oh, that's a great effort. There was very little backlift to indicate what was coming. to finish it's anyone's ball oh surely that deserves better that was created because of good lively movement which pretty much dictated the pass Decent attempt, Peter. Ruiz still goalless. Fakir. And it's Fekir. Juan Miranda. He's making good use of his strength there, just refuses to be outmuscled. And out to safety. Can he capitalise? And another time! Good running with the ball, can they build on it? They've managed to get it away. And they've got it back as soon as they gave it away. Canales. And it's played forward. Oh, good. Has a pop! It's in! Looking 
come back with that. That's how you play on the counter. Quick and decisive and ruthless with the finish. I thought it was a stunning, stunning breakaway. Mallorca take the lead, 1-0. And that ought to be the trigger for a really exciting and entertaining game from here on. Canales. Gets the better of his man. Gets it back. It's a very good battle there, terrific to watch. Great run this, he's covered quite a distance. Floats one over. Bravo catches it safely. And that's going to be the final action of the first half. So there you have it, a close fought half of football. But that has still had its moments. And ultimately produced just one goal. And they be some game up for now. Any opinion you'd like to express on the first half? Well, I think there's plenty to be pleased about with that first half display in terms of the score and, and overall approach. Mallorca leading 1-0 at the break. And the game has already resumed here. A solitary goal. That has been the crucial difference. Hoists it forward. That's just very well played. He can't hurt you with his back to goal, and he didn't go for the back heel. Oh, more than... And he has been fouled there. A really good feat from him. Joaquin with the cross. They didn't manage to get nearly enough into the box. And that speaks of little ambition. Well, it's good stuff. And this is better. Well, this isn't the time to talk about risks now, Jim, is it? They just have to hurl everything at it and hope for a break. It just has to be done. Forward it goes. Your impression so far, Jim? Well, Peter, if they're attempting to see out the game with such a, a narrow advantage, these room hits one! And in it goes! And with that goal comes comfort! That was a given. It always was. Yeah, and teamwork was key to that. A beautiful piece of uh, engineering to, to set him free in the box. Time for a change in personnel. <laughs> Mallorca get themselves a two-goal cushion. Well, that second goal has given them so much more command and confidence now, and they should be able to take it on from here and either add to their lead or, or close it out. Surely they'll manage one or the other.
get the better of his opposite number. Whistle's gone, that's a foul. Oh, no, that's not the ball he wanted. And now they can launch a counter. He wasn't very far from making something happen by himself. Lovely to see. This is gone, that's a foul. It's broken loose. Fakir has a hit. That has certainly tested the keeper. The keeper really dug out his defence then. A magnificent effort. Fakir plays it short. Ball shows there will be three extra minutes. Tries to get it forward quickly. Has a pop! Yes! And they are pulling clear here. Urge to shoot, and he truly delivered. It's really a problem when that much time is afforded the penalty box. Nobody sensed where the danger was lurking, and the finish was made a lot easier. He's made it free, quite a day at the office for him. Well, he's been the outstanding player on the pitch, and devastating in front of the goal. What a display, what a player. Mallorca taken, and there goes the final whistle. Mallorca yeah. irresistible here, dominant, utterly ruthless, only ever one result, a comfortable win. Your final thoughts, Jim? Mallorca were very impressive here, Peter. The backbone of this team is so strong, and it proved to be the decisive area.